The following presentation is about a small Wisconsin town being altered by progress and some of its passionate citizens. My name is Ted Phelps and I've lived here for 24 years. It's nice to have new things and new, ch new changes, but I personally am not a big fan of huge developments, huge apartment buildings, huge anything. You know, a comic's a small town, that's why I love it. There's so many things going on in Wakamwak, sometimes it's hard to tell. I mean, it could be new development, it could be revamping of old businesses, but I think things that are coming in, uh, they can be good, they can be bad. It depends on what it is. You know, you want to keep that small town feel, but you don't want to, you know, have just a stagnant town with businesses that are failing. You want to be able to keep it new and updated, but you still want to keep that small town feel that Wakamwak's known for. I also love I love Boulder shoes. Like I mean, I got shoes there when I was when I was uh, younger. But you know, the business couldn't compete. It it uh, didn't strive, and it went, unfortunately went out of business. And then you have an empty business sitting there, and that doesn't look good for anyone. Uh, my name is Andrew Smith and I have lived in Oconomowoc all my life. My name is Brittany Smith, I am 25 and I've lived here for 13 years. You come out to Oconomowoc here and it's just some place that you just feel at home and comfortable with. Oconomowoc for me means home. Um, it's the only place that I've ever lived and it's the only place I've ever known. Um, I, it's a place I don't really ever want to leave. Um, it's where I work, uh, it's where my family is, and it's, it's a beautiful little city and I don't really feel like I want to go anywhere else.